A nine-story building has a floor-to-floor -floor height of 12 feet. The toilets require a pressure of 15 psi to flush. There's also a pressure drop of 15 psi due to friction. What's the minimum required water pressure at the base of the building? The answer to this question is 77 psi. Let's talk about how to solve this problem. First, you must know that it takes one psi to move a column of water 2.3 feet vertically. The building is nine stories with a floor to floor height of 12 feet, making the height the water needs to travel 108 feet because we multiply nine stories times 12 feet to get 108. Next, we have to take the 108 feet and divide it by 2.3 feet to find out how much PSI is required to lift the water up to the top of the building. This gets us 46.95 PSI, but we have to remember to also factor in the PSI lost to friction and the PSI it takes to actually flush the toilet. So, we have to take our 46.95 psi and add 15 plus another 15. This gets us 76.95 psi, which we can round up to 77 psi. So, the minimum required water pressure at the base of the building is 77 psi. To get more practice before test day, check out our full-length practice exams. You can find the link in the description below. And if you like our free practice question series, then give this video a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss new videos. See you next time. If you want to see more ARE study help, practice questions, explanations, and tips for aspiring architects, be sure to subscribe to our channel. And check out our website, linked in the description below. You'll find full-length practice exams, our blog for aspiring architects, and our free ARE playbook.